Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ness. This is another requested video from you guys and I like that, you know, you guys keep keeping me busy through all this request this video and I actually enjoyed it because most of the time the request this video on some of the shoes that I never thought I would wear or styling with them but you guys actually demand that so here we are, you can ask for it, I deliver it. This year, I see Adidas trying to push a lot of their iconic model with some modern twist design detail on the show, like the pair of Stan Smith like this. I already done my in-depth review on this Adidas Stan Smith looks. If you guys are interested, I'm gonna leave the link in the description box below. And the pricing on this is $145. It's the same price as the Adidas Stan Smith crab. They released, I think like a couple months ago, but I wasn't really interested. And when I have these shoes on my hand, try them on, walking on these shoes, surprisingly, these shoes is very good. Comfort is very nice, perhaps even better than this Stan Smith Lux, in my opinion, because it's softer, more comfortable, and also is more flexible. It's pretty much fit me like any other Stan Smith shoes from Adidas to two size. On the upper of this uh, Stan Smith crib, they used premium suede leather. And also at the side, they don't have the deep Stan Smith name at the side of the shoe, as well as uh, they don't have the metal eyelet on this upper. And on top of the tongue, they don't have that iconic Stan Smith face. Uh, this tongue, they basically just have the deboss of the Stan Smith signature and the material that they use in the lining though around the collar they used leather and when you look beyond that leather collar linings they used a padded textile material for the entire upper even on the tongue as well that's why when I wear the shoes I feel very comfortable soft and very flexible too because they don't use like full length leather linings like the Stan Smith Lux. Uh, this Stan Smith Lux, they use full length leather lining for the shoe. And the foot pad, they also have that leather material from the arch area to the heel. They not full length leather like this Stan Smith Lux. What make me love the shoes is the crib also that they use on this Stan Smith. Crip also is very easy to repair and they age very, very well. I love Crip also in all kinds of different shoes, not just on the Stan Smith, but I think it's kind of refreshing when you see Crip also on the Stan Smith. You also can see Crip also on the Samba as well. I think soon they can release those. And in the heel height, they give you four centimeter height uh, compared to the Stan Smith Lux though, they give you like a two and a half centimeter height. So if you want a little bit taller, you pick the Stan Smith Crib or you pick the Stan Smith Raycon. Styling with these shoes though, I think is very easy. I also like create three different looks with the Stan Smith Lux as well. Um, if you are interested, again, check the link in the description box below. But in this video, this main character is this Stan Smith Crip. I'm gonna create three different looks for this Stan Smith Crip only, and I hope you guys like it.
So there you go. This is my quick review on this a pair of Stan Smith Crib. Uh, what you think about the shoes? Would you buy the shoes and try them on? To me, like the shoes is very comfortable and they are very soft. Um, definitely is the worth buy. I mean, they are elevating the iconic Stan Smith model. You know, they done pretty good job. I give prop to Adidas because they create some of like the best Stan Smiths out there in the market, like this Stan Smith Lux and this Stan Smith Recon, as well as this Stan Smith Crib. Those are just very nice basic sneaker, but you're gonna pay some extra money on the price tag. If you like one of the look in this video, the way how I'm styling with this Stan Smith Crib, comment below in the comment section and give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can't wait to share with you guys. I'm out.